Today on ComTech Engineer, we will be covering how to add an extra hard drive to expand your Steam library storage on Linux Kubuntu. Figured this would be a good update video since the last video I did was about a year or two ago and some things have changed in Steam. So let's go ahead and get started. Step one is you need to, of course, purchase a new hard drive and plug it into your Linux machine and make sure the computer is off before you do this. For the next step, we need to make sure the new hard drive has an ext4 file format system. So let's go ahead and open up the partition manager. And of course it needs administrative credentials to do this, so let's go ahead and type that in. Okay, so just for testing purposes, this is the one I plugged in here. See, it has an unknown file system. So we're going to select that, right click on it, click new. We're going to change this drop down to ext4. You can label it whatever you want. I'll just call mine Steam Games and click OK. Go up here to the top left and apply. Apply pending operations. This should only take a few seconds to complete. Okay. So now that entire hard drive is in the ext4 file format system, we have another important step. We need to change the permissions on this entire hard drive so we can actually write to it. So to do that, we open up our file explorer here. And if we right click inside here, we can see it doesn't even let us create new folders. So we need to change the ownership. So how we're gonna do that, we're gonna open up a terminal. We're gonna change the directory to by default, at least in Linux Ubuntu, it's going to be in the slash media directory. So we're going to cd into there. Type ls to see what's in there. We're going to go into my username is com. So your username will be there also. So we're going to cd into that. We're going to type ls again to see what other directories are inside there. So there we are. Here is my existing hard drive. And the Steam Games, that is the new hard drive we just created the ext4 file format system on. So let's type in, it's going to be a sudo command, so we need to type sudo first, chown, our username, and then the name of the hard drive. So steam games. And it should, let me see if it'll tab complete. There we go, let's try that. And we need to type in our password. Okay, looks like that worked. Now that we have that done, we need to, the last and final step, we need to open up Steam, go up here to the top left, go down here to settings, over here on the left hand side, click on storage, up here at the top of the drop down menu, and then we're going to select add a drive, and there we go, this is the new one we just created Steam Games, so we're going to click add. We can close this. So now just to do a test, let's find a game I don't have installed here. Days Gone. Click Install. And as you can see, this new new hard drive pops up as a, you know, a place I can actually install this game. I won't do it now because I don't need it. But that should be about it. Thanks for watching.